This morning, convicted felon Harvey Weinstein is being held inside a locked unit at Bellevue. He was taken to the hospital after complaining of chest pain. CBS 2's Jenna DeAngelis live outside Bellevue in Kipps Bay with more this morning. Jenna? Chris and Mary, we're told Harvey Weinstein will eventually be taken to Rikers Island to await sentencing, but for now is being treated here at Bellevue Hospital in a prison ward which is locked down. Weinstein waking up in a new place with his new reality as a convicted felon. Day after day, we watched Harvey Weinstein enter the courtroom for his rape and sexual assault trial with a walker. But Monday, he was forced to surrender it, taken away in handcuffs after hearing the word guilty. He didn't cry. He didn't break down. He wasn't sobbing. He was more in a state of disbelief. He just said, I'm, and he just kept repeating, but I'm innocent, but I'm innocent. After five days of deliberations, Weinstein was found guilty of a criminal sexual act and third degree rape. The jury of seven men and five women cleared Weinstein of the most serious charge against him, predatory sexual assault, and also found him not guilty of rape in the first degree. I'm certainly not dissatisfied by the verdict. I think this was a very difficult case. The jury's verdict shows they believed the testimony of Mimi Haley, who says he forced a sex act on her in 2006, and Jessica Mann, who says he raped her in 2013, but had doubts about Annabella Shiora's testimony. In a statement, the actress said, My testimony was painful but necessary. I spoke for myself and with the strength of the 80 plus victims of Harvey Weinstein in my heart. So this is the age of empowerment of women, and you cannot intimidate them anymore. Gloria Allred represents two of the three women the charges were based around. The case gave rise to the Me Too movement. Dozens of women have accused Weinstein of sexual misconduct, including actress Rose McGowan, who had this to say on a conference call. Today is not a referendum on Me Too. This is taking out the trash. This verdict sends a message, I hope to all survivors, that if you speak out and have courage, maybe your day will come too. Again, sources say Weinstein was taken here to Bellevue Hospital after complaining of chest pain. His sentencing is set for March 11th. He faces up to 29 years in prison. We're live at Bellevue Hospital. Jenna DeAngelis, CBS 2 News. Jenna, thank you.